The man convicted of hitting and killing a 64-year-old woman in 2021 will spend the rest of his life in prison. Our Yasmin Ludi was in court today for Colby Martin's sentencing and has the recap from Paw Paw. Melody Rohrer was not just a victim. She was a wife, a mother, and a grandmother. Today, her family shared their grief, adding that this is something they will never forget. September 20th, Melody Rower's family delivering emotional impact statements Monday during Kobe Martin's sentencing, describing the moments their lives changed forever. All they have left now is the memories of the past. Future events will never be the same without her. According to previous testimony, Rower had gone for a walk near Oak Shores Campground, where the family was staying. That was a normal start to her day. But when she never came home and family couldn't get in touch with her, fear set in. We never got to see goodbye. We never got to see the world next time. This makes it even harder for us. While on her walk, investigators say Martin hit Rower with his pickup truck, put her body in his car, and engaged in sexual acts. He later moved her body again, hiding it in a rural area in St. Joseph County. Martin was charged with open murder, failure to stop at the scene of an accident, and concealing the death of an individual. The 31-year-old was found guilty in June on all charges. And Monday, he was sentenced to spend the rest of his life in prison without parole. Melody's husband, Richard, said she represented what was best in this world. And now that she's gone, they will never know how many people she would have helped. Reporting in Paw Paw, I'm Yasmin Ludi, Fox 17 News.